close look at one historic race result, changing Indiana's General Assembly. Democrat J.D. Ford will be the first openly gay state lawmaker, and he did it by beating staunch conservative Mike Delve. State Senator-elect J.D. Ford is here to talk about the victory. Thank you so much for coming in Thank this you. morning. Thank you very much for having me. So you described your campaign strategy as having a personal touch. Yes. And that, how do you see that? Because you say that's missing in politics. I think so. How do you want that to change going forward? Yeah, I think for me, um, you know, as I mentioned last night, we went out and we knocked those doors. We made those phone calls. Uh, and we sent out those postcards and letters to folks that live in Senate District 29. Um, you know, I feel like once people get elected to the, you know, whether it be the General Assembly or Washington D.C., they just go there and they forget about the people who actually sent them there. And I wanted the folks to know that that's not going to be the case when I get elected to the General Assembly. And as mentioned, the historical significance here yes. being the first openly gay member of the legislature. Yes. Do you see that vote of confidence as a turning point on a larger scale? I think so. You know, I, I think that, you know, as I mentioned uh, last night, uh, we had seen a lot transpire uh, about the LGBTQ plus community in our state. You know, we had the HGR3 fight, we had the RIFRA fight, and we saw the fact that uh, the, the bias crimes bill was defeated in the General Assembly this last session. So I think people, particularly people in our district, are ready to move forward. You know, we're ready to close that chapter of being one of five states without a bias crimes bill. What will your first priorities be? First priorities, um, I really believe in education. And so I really want to take a strong look at education and what's going on in our state. I've been doing some substitute teaching, so trying to figure that stuff out. Um, and so uh, I think it's going to be something education and mental health related, just not sure yet. And you also campaigned on a hate crime law. What's your confidence in that passing? Yeah, I think, you know, uh, well, people in our district, I think that's one of the things that they want to see want to see done. Um, you know, we had the synagogue uh, up in Carmel that was, um, you know, had the incident there, and uh, and so I, I think those folks really want to see the passage of a hate crimes bill, and I look forward to working with Governor Holcomb on getting it done. J.D. Ford heading to the state senate. Thank you Thank again you for so your much. time. Thank you so much. Absolutely. Thank Scott, you.